Hey everyone, my name is Stephen Poitras, Solutions Architect here at Nutanix, and today we're going to talk about the Nutanix Converge platform. The Nutanix appliance ships as a bundled hardware plus software appliance, which includes local attached storage resources, including both SSDs and HDDs, as well as compute, including CPU and memory. Each Nutanix node runs an industry standard hypervisor. This includes ESXi, KVM, and Hyper-V. On top of the hypervisor, we run what we call our controller VM, or CVM. The CVM is responsible for handling all the operations, or IOs, coming from any virtual machines running within the cluster, as well as hosting all the Nutanix components and software. Now, a CVM and local attached storage resources realistically won't give us the supportability and availability that we require. So what we do is we actually cluster all of these controller VMs together into a platform which we call NDFS, or the Nutanix Distributed File System. To the hypervisor, this appears like traditional NFS, iSCSI, or SMB3 storage. So the hypervisor thinks that it sees a centralized storage array. However, from an I.O. standpoint, all those I.O.s can actually be primarily served from the local attached SSD, HDD, as well as some of the cache which spans the local attached memory. One of the nice things with this is when you start thinking about scale, which the minimum initial size is three nodes for Nutanix deployment, here I can start with three nodes, which includes three controllers, three hypervisor nodes, three nodes serving both SSD and HDD capacity, as well as three nodes hosting compute capacity. When I actually have a requirement for more storage, more compute, I can actually scale out with more nodes. So that sums up the Nutanix Converge platform. Thanks for watching.